Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about tricks to learning multiplying and dividing fractions with mixed numbers. Now, there's actually one major trick you got to think about when it comes to multiplying and dividing with mixed numbers, and that is definitely convert them to improper fractions. That is a really good first step in doing that because it makes the rest of the problem seem much easier. So let's talk about multiplication first, and we'll go from there. So if you have 1 and 3 fifths multiplied by 2 and 1 seventh, for example, what you got to do first is take every mixed number and convert it to an improper fraction. So, as you know, you have to start with the denominator, multiply by the whole number, so 5 times 1, and then add the numerator. So 5 times 1 is 5, add the 3 is 8, so you have 8 fifths times, and then do the same thing over here. 7 times 2 is 14, plus 1 is 15, over 7, and then you can multiply across, simplify first, and then multiply, and go from there. In this case, 5 and the 15, the 3 stays on top, 8 and 7 don't reduce, so 8 times 3 is going to be 24 over 7. You can convert that to a mixed number if you like, I'll leave that up to you. Now, if you have 4 and 3 quarter divided by 1 and 1 fifth, for example, same kind of idea, convert it to a mixed no, an improper fraction first. 4 times 4 is 16, add the 3 is 19, 19 over 4, divided by 5 times 1 is 5, add the 1 is going to be 6. But as you know, before you divide by any fraction, you have to multiply by the reciprocal. So you've got to flip the 6 over 5 and turn it into a multiplication problem. So this will be 19 over 4 times 5 over 6, and then go from there. So you multiply across. There's nothing to reduce, so 19 times 5 is going to give you 95, and then 4 times 6 is going to give you 24, and then, again, you can convert it to a mixed number from there. So, I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's tricks to learning multiplying and dividing fractions with mixed numbers.